You know how there are Republican right-wing fucktards who are extremely anti-gay, who get caught in bathrooms with their wide stance because they're trying to solicit for sex in public restrooms, right? Yeah. And the people that have been the most anti-gay marriage, they say, oh, it's, it's going to ruin society, they're going to cause all this ruckus, and, well, the ones that are saying that are the ones that are causing the ruckus. So now let's go to transgender issues. The ones that are the most angry about, like, Target, are the ones that are causing the most ruckus. We've got some groups that are, that are going into Target purposely, just guys going right into those restrooms, saying, see, oh, they're trying to make some sort of point. No, the only point they're making is that right-wing fucktards are right-wing fucktards. That's the only point they're making. They're, they're, <laughs> they're showing that the only people that are really truly going to cause a problem are the right-wing fucktards. Most other, just about everyone else, they just want to use the goddamn bathroom. Or a changing room, you know? I've read some stories that talk about women going into some bathrooms and purposely standing there looking through the cracks of a stall to try to make sure that the person that's in the bathroom is uh, the right sex. It's like, excuse me? Excuse me? Who's making people uncomfortable here? It's quite ironic in a very fucked up way. The ones that are making the most big, biggest deal about this are part of the demographic that are actually making the people uncomfortable. Cis people and trans people. And I think what, what pisses some of these people off about the, uh, the transgender bathroom issue is a lot of these people secretly want to be able to go into bathrooms and look at people of the opposite sex. That's what they want to do. And it pisses them off that uh, some people get to do that uh, because they're transgender. And I'm not saying that that's what transgender people do for any sort of sexual anything. They just want to use the bathroom. They just want to change their clothes. And because they don't feel transgender is a valid notion, um, they get jealous because that's really what they want to do. So it's kind of the same thing as when people are the most anti-gay, they're usually gay themselves. So that's why for me, I just think bathrooms should be bathrooms. Changing rooms should be changing rooms. It shouldn't be based on race. It shouldn't be, you know, broken apart based on race. It shouldn't be broken apart based on gender. They're just fucking bathrooms. They're just changing rooms. And if that makes someone that uncomfortable to, <laughs> to be in a bathroom or a changing room with someone of the opposite sex, well, you know, maybe we need to get over the human body a little bit more. Maybe we need to grow up a little bit. Maybe we need to stop living in the 1950s. You know? That's all I gotta say.